Hey, what's up guys? Joseph here from the first ever trailer breakdown. This one is going to be breaking down the trailer for Captain America Civil War. Okay, so if you haven't seen the trailer, I'll put the link in the description below. Go check it out and come back for the breakdown. But, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I, did, I know I did. Um, but... Captain America Civil War is the 13th movie in the MCU. Comes out in on May 5th, May 6th. I can't remember. Um, <laughs> um, but with the trailer, I'm pretty sure I figured out who's going to be on Team Cap and who's going to be on Team Iron Man. It showed most of them, but there's three people. Three people in the trailer. Three people that it didn't show in the trailer. Ant-Man, Vision, and obviously Spider-Man. I really don't think we're going to see anything of Spider-Man until the, about a couple of weeks before the movie comes out in May. Uh, I'll be shocked if we see anything of Spider-Man, hear anything of Spider-Man, anything. But, well, I'll find out. Um, but I'm pretty sure Team Captain America will consist of Captain America, Falcon, Hawkeye, Scarlet Witch, Winter Soldier, and Ant-Man. That one I'm 100% sure now that I think about it because it, it showed Captain America, Falcon, Hawkeye, Scarlet Witch, Winter Soldier running together against Team Iron Man. The only one it didn't show was Ant-Man and I'm pretty sure due to the end credit that Ant-Man will be part of Team Captain America because Falcon mentioned him in the in credit to, to um, Captain America but Team Iron Man will most likely consist of Iron Man, War Machine, Vision, Spider-Man, Black Panther and Black Widow. Now no I'll talk about that later um but in the movie based on the trailer what I gather from it anyways Winter Soldier is on the run from the events of Captain America the Winter Soldier Steve Rod Captain America helps him Captain America and Falcon help him escape from the police that want to kill him and the reason for that if y'all don't know Captain America and the Winter Soldier used to be friends back in World War Two um, but he's on the run. He helps Captain America helps Winter Soldier escape, and because of that, the government wants to register superheroes to make sure they don't do anything stupid, like helping supervillains escape. Um, and Iron Man takes the side of the government once the registration act to commence. Captain America is against it because he saw what it did in um, Captain America 2. I hope, I really don't want them to villainize Iron Man. I'm pretty, it, he's going to be the villain, but I don't want him to be, I don't want them to show he's the, like the, a bad guy. Like in the in the comic, the like Civil War, the one thing they did right was to show who's right, who's wrong. Like in the comics, they didn't say Captain America was the good guy, Captain America's the bad guy, Iron Man was the good guy, Iron Man was the bad guy. It was split 50-50. Who, on who's right, who's wrong. Not going to give away that ending because I don't know if that's going to be the ending of the movie. We'll see. But other than that, I'm real excited for this movie. Um, the one, th one part that stands out to me, well, one of the parts that stands out to me in the trailer was the, um, the ending. Like the ending fight between Winter Soldier, Captain America versus Iron Man. And I don't even know what where they were. Couldn't really tell. Um, but before that fight started, Captain America said, "You to Iron Man, you knew I had no other choice. I wouldn't do this if he was my friend. He 
you know I wouldn't do this if I had no other choice, but he was my friend. Talking about um, Winter Soldier. And Iron Man comes back at him, so was I. That one, it, it shows the breaking of friendships in this story. But I'm really excited for this movie. Um, now, the one thing I didn't, I didn't like, the only thing I didn't like about this trailer, and this, well, it's not really a spoiler because it showed in the trailer. War Machine, and Cap, oh, I'm the Captain, Iron Man's best friend, War Machine, appears to be dead. In the trailer, he appears to be dead. Is he knocked out? Is he dead? I don't know. But with the look of it, he's dead. I don't... I wish they wouldn't have done that, but... I mean, you can sell it as friend turning against friend. That's basically what you would do. Not showing the horrific side of this story. We all know it's going to end and some, not all of the Avengers are going to make out of this movie alive. And apparently, War Machine didn't. Um, but, other than that, uh, yes. Finally showed Black Panther in the trailer. Um, running through a tunnel. Being chased by Captain America. That... Holy crap. That, ju that just shows how much of a match Black Panther is to Captain America. Him outrunning Cap. Yeah, he's... He's going to be something in this, mo this movie. I can, I can already see it. Much... Much bigger than he was in the comics. Like not not all over but in the story. Like in the story in the comics I don't I can only remember Captain America and Iron Man going to Wakanda and talking to Black Panther and that was it in the comics I believe. I can't remember. It's been a while since I've read it. Um but Overall, I'm real excited for this movie, um, but I, I can't wait. Captain America, like, it's Batman v Superman, and then Captain America. Batman v Superman in March, and um, Captain America in May. I, it, 2016 is going to be a big year for movies, and oh man, I can't wait. But that's my thoughts what did you guys think did you see the trailer comment down below let me know and i'll see you on the next one mash out